Hey everyone, I'm going to show you how to join a Flickr group as well as upload some photos to that group. Now, I just set up a Flickr account so I have absolutely no photos in my photo stream yet and I am not a member of the group. So, when you want to join a group, it should have a link to the group URL on its website that you can simply just copy. So here it is, and now I'm going to join the group photo pool. And then here they had already uploaded a couple photos. So here are the photos in that group pool. Now I'm going to upload my own. Now I apologize, the video screencast program does seem to act a little strange when it comes time to upload the photos. So what I'm going to do is briefly just run through how to do it, and then I'm going to explain what I did later. So I'm going to ahead and click Upload, and now this is just simply a drag and drop option. I'm going to pause it here, add a bunch, and then talk about it later. Now I've drug a couple videos over here. Now what I want to do is hit Control A to select all the videos at once, and then I'm going to edit the title and the descriptions by clicking over on the left-handed column of the site. Now these haven't actually been uploaded yet, so what I'm going to do is change the title and descriptions because clubs typically do show the title and the description. So it's always a good idea to maybe add a, a batch of titles that are all the same versus just leaving it the standard name of the file. And then I'm also going to add it to a group, such as the Brainerd Lakes Area Snowmobiles Trail Group. Now you can also add it to a photo set, which is never a bad idea since you're already setting these up. So if this is a ride and you're uploading it specifically for an album, such as the club ride for 12-6-2012, you'd want to add that to that photo set. So I hit Control A, I click over here on the left, and if the video starts acting up, feel free to skip ahead. And then I'm going to click the groups option to add it to the Brainerd Lake Snowmobile group. I'm also going to create a photo set for this ride. And then I'm going to hit create set. And then once I'm done with all that, then I'm going to upload my three photos, which will add it to the group, change the titles of them, and then also add it to my own personal photo set in Flickr. Now you can always use the iPhone app or the Android app or any other of many Flickr applications to upload your photos. So feel free to use what you prefer. And you don't necessarily have to create a Flickr account. I used Facebook to log in, created my Flickr account using that. So then it was easy and quick to set up. It wasn't a whole lot of work on my behalf. Now when we look at the group pool, we see that our photos have automatically been added to that group. And depending on how the group settings are, they will be added to the website as well. So this video is good for anyone who has been a member of the group and is uploading photos, including visitors and riders in your trail system. So feel free to pass this along if they have any difficulty uploading it. Otherwise, adding photos to Flickr is well documented on Flickr itself. It has nothing really to do with club hosting. We just have a neat little script and application that allows Flickr photos to be displayed on your club hosted website. So for any further information on how to set up the club hosting features, please check out our support videos found in the club hosting network support channel on YouTube. Thank you.